everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. With that, it's time to crown the champion of the NFC. And to call the action, we send it to our commentators, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. All right, Larry, it's one of the new jewels of the NFL, no doubt, as you get a look inside U.S. Bank Stadium here in Minneapolis. Coming up, it's a battle to represent the NFC in this year's Super Bowl, and we've got a classic in store between the Atlanta Falcons and the Minnesota Vikings. The excitement level around here at a fever pitch as we're underway in the 2020 NFC Championship game. Fielded about a yard deep. And he's able to get it across the 20, but not by much as he's marked down at the 21-yard line. So here come the Falcons now to get the football for the first time. They'll be led out by the man taking number three overall back in 2008. It's their now veteran quarterback, Matt Ryan. And at times, it's hard for me to believe I'm saying veteran Matt Ryan. Still remember him coming out of Boston College, full of enthusiasm, mastered their two-minute drill in his first OTA. What a player. Double and the D-line pinching together must be expecting the run. They'll run for the first time with Devontae Freeman. And he'll take it ahead to the 28-yard line. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. Well, that run right there was an offensive line coach's dream, wasn't it? Guys picked up all of their assignments, created a nice gap for the running back to get through. Pick up seven yards. Yeah, he's probably chortling on the headset right now, saying, we got it going, boys. Let's keep it going. And brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. It's a pickup of 16 there, and it'll lead to a new set of downs. And when you're playing a quarterback with some experience and some moxie, you enter the danger zone when you decide to blitz him because... And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Anthony Barr. In from his linebacker spot, he's able to drop him for a loss of about 10. And plays like that really hurt play calling. They had a really nice gain on the previous play, but gave about half the yardage back on the sack. Excellent pressure up front. Nowhere to go with the football. Down he goes. No gain on the play this time, and it'll be a third and long situation coming up. Third and long, it's Ryan. And this one is incomplete. They were trying to liven up this playoff game. Very early on, pretty deep throw, but good coverage. I think they were counting on the defenders being a little tight, a little over-anxious early, and trying to catch them flat-footed and get a big play. The punter Bosher on now as he gets this one away. 
Taken in at the 11. Digs with a good footwork. And a second spin. Touchdown, Vikings! Stephon Diggs, 89 yards. And the Vikings have taken a first quarter lead. In a game of this magnitude, it's always good to get out to a great start, but a game of this magnitude, you go up early, that's a big deal. It's a huge deal.